Myth number six. If you have concurrent medical conditions that involve your optic nerve, your retina, or your cornea, then you are not a suitable candidate to receive a premium lens implant. We place a lot of multifocal and premium lens implants in the patients with macular degeneration, epiretinal membranes, mild dry eye, corneal endothelial problems, early mild glaucoma, and they do great. But we advise each of these patients that their final vision with their lens implant after cataract or lens replacement surgery will be potentially limited by the underlying and concurrent structural abnormalities that remain after their surgery. So for example, let's say a person has a cataract or they're very reliant on glasses and they simply want to see their best without glasses and they have a concurrent underlying retina or cornea problem. And let's say that 90% of their blur is from either their cataract or their reliance on glasses and 10% of their blur is from their cornea or their retina problem. Then we'll advise that individual, hey, we could still make your vision better with a premium lens implant, but you will not see 100% perfectly because we can only fix 90% of the problem. 10% of your final vision will be limited because you have a concurrent retina or cornea or optic nerve problem, for example, that will prevent you from seeing your very best. But similarly, if you have a monofocal lens implant, you will still not see perfectly with a monofocal lens implant because those concurrent structural eye problems will still limit your vision even if you have a monofocal lens implant. So our goal is to manage expectations after examining your eye thoroughly and explaining what your most likely visual outcome will be. And we'll simply offer a range of options and let you decide which option is going to help you see your best in the way that you want.